This story starts in 2004. That year, California voters raised the income tax on millionaires to help people who are mentally ill, to cover services like medical care, counseling, and job training. But in recent years, complaints have mounted about how the money is being spent, which brings us to Proposition 2. Hi, I'm Laurel Rosenhall, political reporter with CalMatters. I'm going to explain Prop 2 in less than a minute. This measure expands the ways the state can spend this millionaire's tax to help people with mental illness. With homelessness a huge problem, state lawmakers decided a couple years ago to use some of the money to build supportive housing for mentally ill homeless people. That means it would include treatment programs on site. But then it hit a big snag. A lawsuit contends that using this tax money to build housing actually steals away money that should go only for mental health treatment. So construction is on hold. Lawmakers insist their plan is legal, but rather than wait for the courts to rule, they've put Prop 2 on your ballot. It asks voters to approve the plan lawmakers passed two years ago, borrow $2 billion to build housing for mentally ill homeless people, and use up to $140 million a year from the millionaire's tax to repay the debt. So vote yes if you want to spend some of the millionaire's tax to build housing for homeless people with mental illness. Vote no if you don't want the tax money to be spent on housing. For more on this proposition and others, see our in-depth election guide at calmatters.org.